This is Serenity Leisure's video for this 2008 Swift Conqueror 630 that has just arrived with us in part exchange uh, and is priced at £11,995. Um, you've probably already seen the advertisement which has got lots of photographs and editorial and the object of the video is uh, just to give you a little bit more sort of close-up info. Although it's a beautiful dewy morning here in Bristol and uh, hence all the condensation on the caravans but it'll still give you a pretty good idea okay so down the uh, non-entry level side the Conqueror 630 or this particular one is uh, pretty much spotless I hasten to add I can't find any sort of nasty pimple marks or I can't see any rather um, no cracks in the windows everything's uh, in very very nice condition wheels are unscathed um, the 630 is quite a significantly different model to the 2000, oh sorry, the 2008 630 is quite different to the 2007. Uh, hence the reason as to why there's such a price jump between the two. Um, and I'll uh, go into more detail about that in a little while. Um, back end again, unmarked, nothing on there at all. Moving around to the front of the caravan, running on the Alco uh, hitch with a built-in stabiliser. There we go, as I said, front end all very good and uh, very much the same along the entry level side. I have put this caravan in a little bit close, closer than I like to normally. Uh, Tepford C250 shovel toilet. Yeah, much the same on this side. There isn't, uh, there's a tiny little pimple mark there that you can probably see, but that's where someone's left the key in the door, so it lines up very common. But other than that, externally, it's uh, pretty much spotless. I'll just take the camera and put it up on the roof of the 630 so you can get an idea as to where all the skylights are and also the condition of it. Hopefully that gives you a, uh, a good aerial shot. High intensity rear brake light. Okay, so moving to the interior. Now, 630 uh, is a full berth caravan with a fixed bed. Um, the front lounge here, as you can see, has sort of Alcantara inserts. It's a very nice upholstery. There's an additional uh, table which just pulls out here, folds over, and then there's another one um, which go. If you're just dining for two, that's ideal. But there's another one that goes here, if you so desire. Uh, concertina blinds and fly screens all the way through. There we go, and all the condition of the front and everything is uh, is very good. Upholstery is lovely. I've had lots of these 630s over the years, and uh, it's one of those caravans you sort of like to think you know pretty much inside out. Aldi central heating only apparent on 2008 models onwards, not on a 2007. Stainless steel recessed sink that has a, uh, a drainer and a uh, chopping board which is in this cupboard here. Um, all these drawers pull out. Stainless steel drawers, plenty of storage in there. There you go, there's your drainer and chopping board, cutlery tray, etc. Tucked away. Worktops, you can see. No markings, no dents. Three gas, one electric. Hobbs, that is. Oven is obviously purely gas. Lots of nice storage up here. Um, helmet lighting all the way through uh, on the top of here and also along here, which you can't see unless it's turned on. There's your control panel. Uh, onboard water tank this caravan has. There is a fly screen. Oh, yes. And uh, more importantly, Tepford M150 fridge freezer, the large one. People paying this sort of money. I mean, the Conqueror now is a £28,000 caravan, 630 when new, and obviously, people spending that sort of money expect all the goodies, uh, hence, uh, uh, such as a very large fridge freezer. Um, there's a tiny little sort of um, uh, area there to put glasses. The television is stored here, and then you move into this uh, very nice and spacious. Um, three quarter length, uh, sorry, three quarter um, uh, bathroom, bathroom, bedroom even, with a fixed bed. So this flap comes up here, 
and then the concertina door comes across here and that encloses the uh, bedroom from the rest of the caravan. Uh, here is the status um, uh, television aerial booster and there's your Aldi central heating header tank. Oh, it's properly charging units and everything and RCDs etc underneath here. As you can see this is a great bedroom, it really is. Um, skylight directly above you so you can wake up on mornings such as this one, open that up and uh, and what? Well, feel the breeze. There we go. Aldi central boiler is in there. That's accessible. Uh, this uh, uh, understore, underfloor storage is accessible from the outside via a locker. Uh, into our bathroom. It's a great bathroom again on the 630s. Big double shower. Chrome fittings. There's a light in there. No need for a door because nothing's going to splash through here. Um, see the condition of all of that. This is a uh, storage cupboard. Bits and bobs. Tetford again, the CT50 toilet I already mentioned. Uh, opaque window with that blind again. These are the radiators where the heating comes out in the bathroom. And then you have a, um, uh, like a little sort of towel drying area here. Again the heating comes up from that radiator down there and keeps that nice and dry. Table stores in here. Uh, internal condition excellent very good uh, serenity don't buy caravans that are sort of smell of smoke or um, or pets for that matter even though we have animals ourselves dogs we don't uh, uh, sort of tend to let them in the caravan when we go away caravanning um, because Labradors like to shake and make a mess um, yes so uh, that's about it this is uh, 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 as I said serenity leisures video for this 2008 630 Priced at £11,995.